In this video I'm going to be introducing probability, so the basic concepts. So you'll be used to using words like probable, uh, not so likely, certain, impossible. And these words, if you put them from a line from being impossible up to certain, uh, would start to look like, well, we could put impossible right on the left hand side and then we'd go all the way up to certain and then halfway, well, it could be one or the other, so we'd probably call that 50-50 or evens. So this is where we'd be thinking, well, it's going to be likely and then unlikely. But Although impossible, evens and certain are fixed values, unlikely and likely, they're a bit wishy-washy. They're not strictly in the middle of impossible and evens. I mean, if I go closer to the impossible, then it gets less and less likely. And you know, that's not particularly good for mathematicians. We want things to be exact. So what we're going to do is we're going to take impossible to have a number and certain to have a number. So it'd be nice if we could rate probabilities from zero up to one. And so if, a if an event had a probability of one, then it would be certain. So halfway between this evens, well that'd be 0 0.5. So evens and 0 0.5 are synonymous. So probabilities, we're going to be quite happy to be given as decimals and fractions, to a lesser extent, but as well as percentages. One thing that um, we're not going to be looking at is really ratios in any great detail. And some people at this point start to get confused between ratios and probability and fractions especially with um, the ideas of horse racing. So if a horse is uh, three to one and things like that and gambling and people think that, well, um, one, a probability of one to third can start to be written as one to three and these things are not the same. So probability, stick to decimals, fractions, percentages to a lesser extent, okay? And you'll be looking at these in the next few videos to really concrete in these basic probability concepts.